Welcome back to a look at your weather. That high temperature today did get up into 90 degrees, just sitting around normal for this time of the year. Even looking at last year, we're seeing that those last year temperatures are a little bit cooler, seeing that that low is even going to get down to 53 degrees. We're seeing a little bit more humid for this time of the year as we did see Tropical Storm Gordon move on through, making it feel a little bit more sticky outside. There was a trace of rain that moved on through, bringing in just a light shower, but we were able to get that sun back out and say it stays pretty sunny until the sunset year later tonight. We are seeing that we're having that dew point here right now at 75 degrees, so still feeling a little bit stickier outside as we're having a lot of that tropical moisture still move on through. But looks like a cold front may be moving on through, which is going to allow us to cool down a little bit, but bring some more showers, unfortunately. This is that low pressure system that is Tropical Storm Gordon. It should be turning into a trop post-tropical storm here just in the next couple of hours, actually. And then this stationary front may be turning into a cold front. That's what's going to be bringing in those showers. As you can see, a lot of the stationary front is a part of Gordon that's going to be holding a lot of moisture and then be bringing in those, again, those showers for us potentially as we move into early on next week. We're seeing that there's still those potential scattered showers across much of the state. They are dissipating as we move into the evening hours, which is going to allow us to stay fairly dry. Seeing that there also are some flash flood warnings that are still in the northern parts of the state, but it looks like they should be expiring here as we move into the weekend if we stay dry for the next couple of days. But if we have this rain, it does look like those may be returning for us as we move on. Seeing that that low temperature tonight is going to get down to 71 degrees, but still feeling fairly sticky as it looks like that humidity is going to be around throughout the overnight hours. So not going to be a cool one just yet, even though those temperatures are getting a little bit lower overnight. Looks like it will be a little bit cloudy as we wake up in the morning, but that sunshine should be coming out in those early morning hours and maybe a small chance of precip tomorrow afternoon. But for the most part, it should be a beautiful Saturday for much of the Mississippi state. Forecasted highs for tomorrow getting up to 90 degrees yet again. And again, there may be just that small chance possibility of a thunderstorm in the afternoon. What we're seeing is that we're still staying in that humid and sticky area and then having those storms still stay off to the west of our area, but there's still just all that tropical air that's moving up that's going to cause maybe that potential for a storm that's going to be moving on through. We're also just taking an eye look at um, Florence that's changing in the Atlantic. We were seeing that it was potentially going to be heading north and just kind of skimming right by the eastern coast, but now it's taking a turn. It looks like it's going to be heading towards and we'll have to keep an eye on it as we move to the weekend, but it does look like it is going to maybe potentially make landfall just around the Carolinas. As we move into the weekend, we're going to see that there are going to be some showers likely starting Sunday, Sunday afternoon possibly, and then Monday and Tuesday is when we see that cold front move on through, seeing that those temperatures are going to cool off and likely are storms moving on in. And then it looks like that sunshine does return, those temperatures getting back up to normal, but that humidity will return, making it feel tropical just one more again.